daylight savings time has started and you don't know how to change the clock in your Subaru? G'day, I'm Thomas from Schlossman Motors and today I'll show you how to update the time and date in some of the most popular Subaru models. We're going to start with this 2015 Subaru Forester equipped with a 4 inch multifunction display. The first thing you're going to want to do is locate the controls for the display. These are just down here to the lower left side of the steering wheel. Now, you're not looking for the buttons that say mode or have a picture of a telephone. Those steering wheel controls are used to manage the phone or the audio system. But this little screen is controlled using the multifunction display controls. To enter the setup menu, the first thing you'll want to do is press and hold the I slash set button. To activate one of the buttons, you simply pull it towards you. Now we're in the setup screen, so you'll use the directional arrows up or down to navigate to where you want to in the menu. To get to the date and time, we're going to go into date. Perhaps it's not the most intuitive, but to change the time, we are going to go into the date setting. So just for clarity, first you enter the menu, then you enter date, and then you enter date again to change the time. Once you're in the second date setup screen, it's pretty simple. Just use the down and up keys, as well as the set button, to enter whichever value you'd like to change, make the change using the up or down arrows, and then press set again to save that change. Once you're happy with it, go down to set, and your date and time settings will be saved. And here's a tip. Once you've got the hours and minutes set up correctly, you can actually just go into the daylight saving time setting and then change it to on or off. And you're done. Now, if your Subaru doesn't have a 4-inch multifunction display and instead it's got a small digital clock somewhere set apart like this Outback, well, I've got great news for you. It's super easy to set the clock. If your Subaru has a standalone digital clock, all you have to do is find the small plus and minus buttons, and generally these are going to be really close to where the clock's display is. If you want to go ahead an hour, just press the plus button. If you hold it, it'll jump in 30 minute increments, and like that, you've jumped ahead by one hour. And when daylight savings time ends, you just do the same thing with the minus button. And it's as easy as that. 